A former Casa Chiefs player, David Matebula, has got this interesting things to say concerning the transfer transfer things that, or transfer signings that uh, occurred at Casa Chiefs. He says it's actually one of the best things that have ever happened at Casa Chiefs. He believes that come next season, guys, we're gonna have a very different Kaiser Chiefs. Come next season, guys, we're gonna have a, a very progressive Kaiser Chiefs. He also pleaded that, guys, let's let's apply a little bit of patience to these uh, players. Let's support them. Let us be patient as well for others. One. So if you stick around, guys, I'm gonna give you more. So are you interested? Please stick around. To those that will stick around guys if you are not yet subscribed what are you waiting for because to subscribe it is free to like the video it is free to comment in the comment section below good people it is free of charge now the former Kaza Chiefs player David Matebula was speaking to the kickoff.com and also some interesting things to say let me just sorry let me just get into this one then we're gonna have a comment after that he's got this to say I think it was a very good window for the for, for the Chiefs. Né? They went out and got the players that would have fit the style of play. They sorted out their business early, even before the transfer window opened. David Matebula's uh, comment to Kaiser Chiefs. Wow, he says the following: Individually, there are great players who can be competitive, but the true test will be when it when when it's time to see how they are. How they integrate into the team. I trust Atazwan and Dylan Shepard. They have signed these players with an idea in mind of how to use them. Wow. Right, right, Matebula. Yeah. Um, Nami, when I'm at, when I'm David Matebula, I also trust. Um, I also trust who, who's this guy? Who Atazwan and Dylan Shepard that they signed these players. Um, with a view in mind and how they're going to use them and how they're going to assemble the team going forward So there's nothing much nothing less that I'm hoping for with regards to card achieves and moving forward I'm, I'm just hoping I'm just wishing that nothing but the best. I'm, I'm hoping as well that they are able to easily adjust to the system and they are able to easily understand the culture of the club and also one of the key factor for players is to understand each other's strength and there's nothing so much important than that um, like like you know when i talk about each other's strength i'm talking about look at the likes of kama billiard and gigendon they understand very well that okay if kama billiard is here i've got a ball then this is how i need to pass kama billiard so if you can find players that can easily adjust to that, I can tell you that that team becomes a dangerous team. Like Mamelo Sandals players, they all know each other by now. So they all understand each other's strength and weakness. And they are able to protect each other's strength and weaknesses as well as they are playing. And once a team gets to that level, then that's the only time a team can perform to the best of their ability. They can be attractive to the spectators, which is what you are looking for. And they can start competing domestically and internationally. They can start commanding their spaces because they now understand their strength. There's nothing much, much important in life than a human being that understands their strength and their weaknesses such people are very dangerous because they know that okay if you are to attack me here i'm weak so i need to protect my weakness and uh, my weak point um, as well as they understand their strength and they understand that if i can consistently do this then i'm, I'm gonna become the master of or at what i do and i'm gonna be successful because i'm very much consistent in my strength you know what i'm saying and they are able to attack on their strength so should Kaza Chiefs reach that level very much, look very early, I can tell you that they will be a deadly team to watch. They will be a very fearful team, unlike previous season, uh, coaches like, um, who's this coach? I forgot the name of this coach. Uh, oh, Dan Dan Smalisela. He was very upset to have, did he lost or it was a draw? I think he lost to, to Kaza Chiefs. He says that this is not a team that should have beaten us. They are not a deadly team. We all know that. For coaches to even boldly tell you that, it tells you that they did nobody feared Kaza Chiefs in the PSL, in even in the lower division. But the Kaza Chiefs that I think they are building is a Kaza Chiefs that will be feared by a lot of people. 
but also subject to how these players are easily gelling to each other to what or gelling uh, in, in the system and understand each other now i don't know your opinion but there's only one way for me to know what's your opinion about that it is for you to get into the comment section below let that conversation begin right now right here